a new gym that has opened up here in Duke City a few months ago, and they offer a lot more than just the opportunity to uh, look good for swimsuit season. Hear more on the opening of Who a Fit is the owner and director of communications, Megan Kavanaugh and William Duran. Duran, excuse me. Morning. How Morning. are you guys? I Good. told you I messed up your name. Nah, I always no do worries. it. Right. Okay, so you got a new gym. It's called Who a Fit. Yes. All right. The, the name's a little different. It Let me is. Explain it. Absolutely. So Who a Fit. Who is actually a military term that stands for heard, understood, and acknowledged. Okay. So it's some, it it's basically means anything but no. And that's something we want to kind of put into all of our, our clients and members and students. So I can't go to your gym, who will fit, and be like, no, that's too hard. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. That's too hard. Yeah, we're going to figure it out. Yeah. If it's something can't we do can't do, then, then we'll figure out a way to do something else, modify it. Okay, very yeah. cool. So, so what's, the, what's the gist of the gym? Like, is it just like a place with some dumbbells? You can do a lot of classes. Is it? I know CrossFit's really popular these it's, days. Kind of. What it is. You know, it's uh, it's definitely functional fitness, um, and we do everything from from one on one base to group style training to camps. So if you have a you know a group of people that want to come in, we'll work with everybody and anybody. Okay. Yeah. Uh, you talk about functional. What's it? Seems like a it's a the the workout word of the of the the year of the month. Like it's right. just been happening a lot. What does that what mean for someone about? who doesn't understand that? Uh, basically, that we're using all of our body's different mechanics and not just isolating any one thing. That we're actually putting the body to use. That's going to help us in our daily living. Okay, so you're not just talking about, you're not going to go there and just go like, you're going to tell someone, hey, do some curls. Right, we're not just going to go for our glamour muscles. We're oh, go man, for, <laughs> we're I'm gonna, out. We're going to go for a little bit of everything there, yeah. Okay, uh, so you talk about a little bit of everything. What kind of programs do you offer, Megan? Um, well, our main program right now that we're offering is the Training for Warriors program. Yeah. Okay, what is that? Well, it, well, it looks like these people are training to be warriors right there. Yeah. Oh, you got the sled. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, yeah. yeah, so exactly. the Training for Warriors program is actually, it's a, it's a physical and mental training program. So we're not just pushing ourselves physically, but it's also mentally we have to start working and, and learn how to develop ourselves and push past those, those boundaries. Okay, so what you're saying is it's not easy. And um, you got to tell yourself Absolutely. it's not easy. To be. Yeah. Absolutely, it yeah. goes back. There is a there is a book. Our friend Dr. Curl will know this, but it's uh, by Dr. Scott Peck, and I think like the, it's the road, called the Road Less Traveled. And like the first couple lines, and it says life is difficult. When you realize life is difficult, life gets a lot easier. Yeah. Right. So I assume the workout and your mentality about it is Absolutely. the same way. Absolutely. Absolutely. But you know, I think one of our clients described it most appropriately, saying it was appropriately exhausting. Yeah. Yeah. Which absolutely. means you know you're not going to leave throwing up in a bucket you know what I mean you're not oh, gonna leave man. hating life that's and what just, I when I go to a gym yeah. that's my goal <laughs> it's not about overworking it's about working correctly and and at that right pace and okay. you leave feeling energized even though you know that you've gotten a workout yeah. so it's not about crawling out you know yeah. just so super exhausted you can't take on the rest of the day yeah. it's that good burn that makes you want to go back you want that feeling again I yeah. think that's exactly what you're going you, you almost addictive. leave wanting more like yeah. I could have probably done like another 15 minutes and that's what we want we don't yeah. want them to leave just I can't so even tired drive away. and right. so sore yeah. the next day that they don't want to come back. You don't back. want they half don't cramps as you're driving. Exactly. exactly. I can't yeah. even shift your exactly. car. Yeah. Uh, one of the great things I think you all are doing that's a little bit different than what a lot of gyms do, you have charity workouts. We do. Please explain yep. this. So the, the charity workout, what we're doing is that um, actually coming up here on the 28th, this upcoming Saturday, we'll be doing a charity workout. It's uh, it'll be from it's at 10 o'clock. It'll be about an hour, hour, 15 minutes. Kind of a class. Yep. It's a okay. $10 dollar donation in order to get into the class. It'll be a huge group setting, something that brings a lot of energy, a lot of excitement, and 100% of the proceeds that we make that day will actually go towards uh, the charity of our choice. And in this case, it's going to be the, the Mariposa Network. Helps people with uh, TBI. Yep. Traumatic, traumatic brain, brain injury. injury. Yep. So for that, uh, any level, do you have to be a member? Nope. Mm -hmm. Nope. It's for just anybody and everybody. Yeah, yep. Open. Just okay. come on by just and we'll have something donation. for everybody. Okay. Absolutely. And now for the rest of the gym, um, besides that, do you, do you have, uh, have drop-in fees? Do you have monthly memberships? We do. How does that all yeah, work? Yeah. So it's all, it's all dependent on what that person wants to do. And, and, and it's very, very organized specifically to that person. Person. So okay. if it's, hey, I want more of a class setting, we have a class okay. setting based fee. So it's individualistic, same. Thing. Everything is curtailed to what people want, exactly. basically. Exactly. Yes. Yeah. It's all programming designed to tail somebody's needs. Okay. Yeah. The gym is called Who a Fit. Once mm -hmm. again, what does Who a Fit mean? Who a Fit's uh, heard, understood, and acknowledged. Yes, and sir. Fitness. All yeah, right. Absolutely. Megan and William, thank you yep. so much for more thank information you. about Who a Fit. Heard, understood, and acknowledged. Go to casa.com, click on the Casa blog. All the information is right there. You can also find out about the charity workouts. Yep. Thanks for coming Thanks. in. Appreciate